All right, guys, all the food is done. I am beyond starving. This yeah. looks so good. Smells amazing. We got some lobster tails right here, ribeye right here, some garlic mashed potatoes, yeah. asparagus. You did amazing, babe. What's okay, good, guys? guys? Back with another video. In today's video, my girlfriend's gonna be making me surf and turf. Specifically, she's making steak with some lobster tails. Have you ever made surf and surf before? Not with lobster tails. These are all the ingredients right here, and Zach will put them right here. Right here. Today, I'm gonna be making steak, lobster tails, mashed potatoes, and asparagus. Let's do it. But first, if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any uploads. First, let's make our mashed potatoes. Wash and peel the potatoes. Potatoes going in. Eee, careful, babe. Eee. Careful, careful, careful. Okay, okay. And then add your salt. Time to prep our lobsters. You've never done this before. You're nervous. I've never done it. I am. I am. I'm going to cut the shell two thirds way in, and then I'm going to prop up the meat. Ooh, Ooh. You hear the crunch of Then I think you break this open a little bit. Oh, God. I hope I'm doing this right. All right, then take all the gunk out. We don't want that. This is what it's supposed to look like, I think. Now let's season them. Monkey, what are you waiting for? You're not getting any lobster. You're not getting any lobster. You're not getting any lobster. First, we're gonna salt and pepper our lobsters. And now some pepper. Then let's make our butter mixture. Butter going in. Creole seasoning going in. Don't be shy. Cajun seasoning going in. Garlic powder going in. Some parsley going in. And finally, some fresh garlic. Now mix. Now let's sauce them up. Alrighty, let's fill Ooh. them up. That Just looks good. Like that. Oh wow. Let's get detailed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Don't forget to add some lemon juice. Ooh. Now let's get back to our mashed potatoes. Let's strain the potatoes and they go back in the pot. Ooh. Now time to mash. Hiya! Some unsweetened almond milk. Now mix again. It doesn't sell. <laughs> Stop! Some salt and garlic powder. Ooh, quick taste test. That's good. Next, let's work on our asparagus. Ends coming off. Ooh, that was satisfying. Wow. <laughs> Wait, let me see. That was really satisfying. Quick rinse and we're ready to go. Let's lay them out. Olive oil going in. Salt. And pepper. And some crushed red pepper. Pop, pop, pop. All right, let's put our asparagus in. 375 for 15 minutes. Now let's get to the steaks. Olive oil, rub it in. Massage. Salt. Pepper. Asparagus is done. Let's take it out. Ooh, looking good. Now let's put our steak in. 250 for 15 minutes. Here we go. Okay, it's been 25 minutes. Now let's reverse sear it. Lobster tails going in. 400 for 12 minutes. Let's reverse sear the steak. Sorry, audio, we need to turn the fan on. Let's reverse sear these, all right, ready? Woo! Yeah. That's good. All right, it's been about two minutes. Let's flip. Ooh. Oh my God, that looks Dang, perfect. that looks good. Okay, time's up. Woo! Wow, check Lots that out. Done. At least I hope so. Damn, those look good. All right, everything's done. Now let's plate. Mashed potatoes going in. All right, let's cut into the steaks. Let's see it. Let's see it right here. All wow, right. I thought I overcooked that's it. Perfect. Get mashed potatoes going here. Lobster tails right here. Oof. One, two. Damn. Jeez, look at this one. Three. And then you, what happened to this one? All right, this can't make it on the plate. Maybe I should make lobster mac and cheese. You yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yes, right? Yes. Okay. All right, watch out. Coming through. Steaks going on. Damn. Sheesh. And then let's put our asparagus just like this as a divider. Woo! All right, and this is the final product. Look so at enter. this. Damn, baby. Woo! All right, let's eat. But before we do that, if you guys made it to this point in the video, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. All right, guys, all the food is done. I am beyond starving. This yeah. looks so good. Smells amazing. We got some lobster tails right here, ribeye right here, 
some garlic mashed potatoes, yeah. asparagus. You did amazing, babe. What are we doing first? Let's scoop out the mash. Ah, there you go. Scoop out the mash. That's for you, that's for you, here. Thank you. Thank you. Do -do 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 -do. Okay. I'm so excited, oh my I'm gosh. Starving. You ready? Yes, I am ready. Come on, pop, pop it on there. Ooh, nice. You probably need a little bit more, huh? That's what I'm saying, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> More. <laughs> <laughs> you sure? That's valid. That's a lot of potatoes. That's valid. It's all about the ratio. Okay, okay, okay. One and a half to for you. Mm, mm, mm. Here you go, madam. Thank you. One lobster tail for me. And then one lobster tail for you. Oh, I was about to say for you. I thought you said Look for at you this, again. guys. <laughs> Look at that. Look at I hope that. it's focused. Would you look at that? Steak? Let's, let's put some steak in our plate. All right, all right. Come. You got it. You could, you could take your, your pieces. Nah, you want the... I like the, the non-fatty pieces. It here. works perfectly. Here. She likes all the fatty pieces. I like the non-fatty pieces. Two. Okay. Put it on me. Three. That's Damn. Good. Is that good for you? Yeah, that's good for me. Look at these pieces. Oh my god. from this side, because... Wow, oh, babe. this is really fatty, though. But... No joke, if we got this plate, and let's say like Bro. a steak restaurant, it'd be like sixty dollars. For sure. I'll take one lime for me, one lemon for me. Mhm. Mm I'll take a lemon too. Okay. Okay. Wait. Got some asparagus on there. Oh, your plate looks nice. I know. I know. Here, you want some of this? Yeah. Where do you want that? Throw it on. Boom. Wow, baby. <laughs> this might be like the bougiest thing we've ever made. What are we doing first? I don't know. I need a sip. I need a sip. Bro. Water? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, yo. I got some kombucha here. You got some water. Cheers. Cheers. Good job, babe. That's right. That's good. All right. Um, yo, let's do the mashed potatoes first. Oh, yeah. Let's just try All right. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Garlic mash. Cheers. Cheers. I'm so hungry. That's good. That's good. Not too much flavor, but... It balances out with everything. It's good. We didn't put any butter. It was just garlic. Nope. Un unsweetened almond milk. Mm -hmm. Salt. So I'm very happy with that. I know. You didn't want butter and all mm -hmm. that. Okay. It's all right. Steak. steak. Let's do it. I don't want to get a knife. You just gonna bite it? Yep. Okay. All right, baby. Steak. Steak. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Yo. You really taste the rosemary and thyme and all that. Mm-hmm. Mm. Also, again, for the steak, we didn't have to like butter and mash up. Mm -mm. It's definitely not as good. Not as like smooth, you know? Mm -hmm. But but the flavors are out. The flavor's amazing. Also, I was so, I was about to cry because I thought I overcooked the steak. Because mm -hmm. I put the term temperature mm -hmm. in and it was like 140, but it's good. It is really good. Um, you want to like, chase it down with asparagus? Yeah? Asparagus, pee pee, make sure pee pee sneaks. Pee pee sneaks. <laughs> mm, that's fire. Simple. Yo, why is that so good? Simple. Yeah. Man. Also, the red pepper flakes. Good, right? Yep. I told you. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, let me just have to steak real quick. Potato. Mm. Okay. I'm ready for this because I've never made this before. I really hope it's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's cleanse our palate before. Which is really good. This one is hum. hum. Mango passion fruit. How we do this? I don't know. Okay, I think lemon first, yeah? Or no? Okay, let's do a little bit of lemon. Little, a little bit, right? Because I already did a little bit, so. I'm just gonna do a very little bit. I don't want it too acidic. That's good for me. Okay. Alright. Okay. Well, look at these. <laughs> look at these. Whoa. So it just it just well, first of all, it come it, it, it can just come yeah. off or just like this. Look. Yeah. Wow. I should take it. Or should I take it out? I'm taking mine out. I'm taking mine. Out. All right. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Yo. I don't think I've ever had lobster tail like this. This at is a restaurant. fire. I couldn't afford it. Yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> wow. How'd you take it out? Look at that. How'd you take it out? Carefully. Would you like my assistance? 
I got my hands all dirty. Oh, you got it, didn't me? Oh yeah, I got it all. Ready? Wait. Wait, hold up. Three, two, one, go. Cheers! Look at this, guys. Look at that. Let's do a cheers. Wait, Are you cutting wait, wait. it? Yeah, I'm cutting it. Why are you right. going to one bite it a lot? I'm not going to one bite it. I'm just going to take a one. I'm going to take a one. <laughs> I'm going to take one bite of a piece. Of it. All right, all right, all right. I'm cutting it. You want to cut it? fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll cut it. Here, here's the knife. I'm so excited. This is like a $10 piece of. This is like a $10 bite right here. Yeah. All right. Ready? Lobster. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Oh my god. That's cooked perfectly. Oh my god. You really thought I was like the 15th time making that. Wow. Best thing on the plate by far. Yo, it is like not chewy. It's smooth. Like, okay, it is a bit salty for me. Yes, I was just gonna say that, but with well, the mashed yes, potatoes. Yes, yes. There you go. But whoa. The, the texture? Yeah, is it, is it like, did I undercook it, you think? Nah, babe. Wow, that's good. Fire. Give back my knife. All right, now let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. Do you think it's worth $70 for four? Six. For six? Yes. I think it's worth for it. For sure. I think it's worth it. For sure it's worth it. Mm -hmm. $70 for six. Like, we're probably only gonna eat one each, right? And mm -hmm. this probably leftovers, and we have another. I don't know, but yeah. Worth, this one. worth it. Okay. Wow. Okay, I'm eating now. That is impressive. Okay. I need to taste it again. Mmm. Good bust on that. You know what I'll do next time? So I salted the lobster and I salted the butter. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna only salt one. You know, and also keeping in mind the Creole seasoning, Cajun seasoning, super salty as well. Mm -hmm. So maybe I don't even need salt. But it's good with the mashed potatoes though. Wow. Wow, oh wow. I'm not gonna lie, Zach, you might not, you don't, you won't feel like crap. Like, mm -hmm. this, this is pretty, this is pretty good. I mean, it's the, I put a lot of butter for the lobster. Cause like, I, know. I think like that all the recipes that I looked up, you need a lot of butter. Yeah, I mean, So. I did use that, but, but the also, steaks and all with that. With the lobster, you just take a little piece of bite. Yep. A little bite, and then you eat it with the mash. Perfect. Yep. I would rate the lobster texture mm -hmm. 10 out of 10. The flavor, if it wasn't too salty, I would give it a 10 out of 10. But a little bit too salty, I'm gonna give it an 8.5. Mm -hmm. The steak, I'm giving it a I'm giving it a solid eight. Ten. Solid eight. Yeah, ten. The asparagus for what it is, it's a ten. You think so? Yeah. I don't really give out ten, so I'm gonna say lobster. I, I, I think the. Uh, I, I mean, I'm starving. Right yeah, now, I so. know, I know. I, I say the lobster is nine out of ten. Mm. Cause first time cooking lobster and you get that texture, come on. Usually when you go to like I don't know a restaurant. You gotta bite it and like. Ugh. Yeah, it's it's like chewy, you know. They overcook it always. Yeah. Oh. Texture of that is fire. Nice. My bad. You good. We should make next. <laughs> I've been pretty busy, so it's hard to cook. Mm. The mashed potatoes. If you want it to be like amazing, amazing, you don't just butter, man. I would butter, I would cut up some rosemary in it, some chives. Throw mad butter in there, throw a little bit of cheese too. Oh, bacon bits. Yeah. Bacon yeah. bits, that's what everybody asparagus, does. Asparagus, I put some like Parmesan cheese on nah, top. Nah, nah, nah. Someday, I make the asparagus, uh -huh. put an egg wash, some breadcrumbs, air oh, fry. Oh, bread asparagus? Fire. And if you want it to even be more unhealthy, yeah. you put it into like a, you pan fry it. It comes out crispy, it's thin, crunchy, it's so good. But I mean, it's not gonna be healthy. Yeah. yeah. I hope you guys have food in front of you, watching us eat and have our food in front of us. I really do. So, look at monkey. Good boy. Mm -hmm. That's good, right? Go three. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, guys, this is so good. Keep in mind, we're not eating eating any of this fresh. Mm -hmm. Like, come on. Yeah. Imagine this fresh. 
Satan's had multiple times, but imagine. It took a while to make though. It was like a three hour process. Kind of. I mean, we well, took our time. We were like chilling, taking our time, watching TV, but mm -hmm. it took a while. For, but also everything needed to go, except for the mashed potatoes, needed to go in the oven. Mm -hmm. Except for, yeah, except for mashed potatoes, but they were all at different temperatures. That's why. A quick update for you guys. We are back in Texas, obviously. Um, we're not sick anymore. 100% no, healthy. We're good now. Yep. T has been at work pretty much every day. She is in her busy season, so it's gonna get a little bit hectic around here. I'm tough. Um, but another thing is we just got our first real gym memberships. Mm -hmm. um, it was really expensive, but we think it's a good investment for ourselves. It's close by, we're gonna be going. Yeah. And yeah, we're gonna be going to the gym all the time, eating great food, so. I'm excited. Yeah, quick update. 2022. Also, let us know if you guys came from TikTok and saw our TikToks that we made of this food. I'm just curious to see. Yeah. I would say that's one of the biggest struggles when it comes to making all this food is that like our thinking behind it is we're going out buying all this really expensive food and we're in our head we're like, all right, if we're gonna do this, we gotta make a lot of videos and make it worth it, right? right. So when we do that, we make the YouTube video, we post a lot of TikToks, but the thing is, when we do that, we don't get to eat the food fresh because all this food was made and then literally an hour later after a thumbnail, after pictures, after videos, multiple videos, multiple recordings, then we eat. And like, it's great, like don't get me wrong, but one struggle that we face is that we don't get to eat the food fresh yeah. as you guys know. So let me know your thoughts on that. Do you guys think that we should just scratch that and just eat the food fresh? Or do you guys enjoy seeing those videos? Let me know. I mean, but then, if we don't do those videos, then they won't see this, right? There's another thing, yeah. Or it won't be a good thumbnail, then maybe you won't have gone, click the video, you know? Mm -hmm. I used to never think about that stuff, like I never realized, oh wow, I clicked this video because of the thumbnail. But subconsciously, I really did. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. I'll probably eat after this. I know, I I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna do that. I'm satisfied guys. I'm super satisfied. Not full, but satisfied. Okay. Would you be able to eat everything? No. There's no way. This is okay, too okay. much mashed potatoes. Let's say if it was half of that. Half the mashed potatoes? No, like 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 you know how it's tower? Yeah. It was just half. half? I could finish all the steak easily. Easily. Half the mashed potatoes, yes. I can only eat two of these because it's too salty. What yeah. if it wasn't salty? I think so, yeah. Yeah. But no, there's no way I can finish this whole thing yeah. mashed potato. There's too much. Be leftovers. Yeah. Great leftovers. That's yeah. gonna be amazing leftovers. What would you eat this way? We could just do some chicken thighs or if you yeah. even, even make chicken wings. Like the, if you make something crunchy with it, it'll be fire. Yeah. So you're just gonna watch me eat. Yeah. <laughs> even though I'm still hungry. Gonna control myself. Control. We're done eating. I am super satisfied. Like I said before, this is amazing, babe. I think we're definitely gonna revisit this again. Yeah. We still have two more in the freezer. Maybe make some lobster mac and cheese, some fire real quick. Mm -hmm. Deal with that with some Cajun spikes on top. Ooh, that's coming soon. That's coming soon. Um, but anyways, coming to the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So we're experiment. Yes. Wow, it's been a while. I was just gonna it say. It's been a while, guys. Go for it. Okay. If you made it to this point in the video, make sure you comment down below the word surfboard. Surfboard? Okay. Surfboard. Surf and turf? Yeah, I like surfboard. The theme. I like the theme. Anyways, guys, like I was saying, this is the end of the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We're going to be posting a lot. Weekly uploads. Not daily, but weekly. So weekly. you guys can expect that. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.